Fred, you are the ultimate story. Undrafted in the NBA, they took a chance on you. You end up coming up huge in game six of the NBA Finals, and now you are an NBA champion. Can you even put into words what this moment means to you? No words. It's no words. Um, everything doesn't need a description. Everything. You know, everything. You know where I come from. Everything. You know how, what it took to get here. Better yourself, um, baby. You know what I say. Better yourself. Better yourself, baby. Unbelievable franchise, unbelievable teammates, unbelievable coaches. And uh, just to be here in this moment is so special. And to, to do it for the city of Toronto and the, the country of Canada, you know, is, is even more special. You talk about where you're from, Rockford, Illinois. They had their own Jurassic Park. What do you say to everyone at home? It's for the rock, big man. Big time. They know how I am. Freddie, big time, baby. They know I rep the rock. Is hard that where, boy wherever bad, I go, man. I rep Rockford. And uh, I carry that flag proudly. And I'm just so happy to be able to represent my family, Rockford, Illinois, and Toronto and Canada as well. So, uh, unbelievable, man. It's unbelievable. What, is, what does it mean to you to be part of the first team in franchise history to win an NBA title? And just the support that has been across this country. Uh, it just feels so good to be able to pay respect, to be able to pay back. Uh, these fans are, are ruthless. Our fans are ruthless when you're not playing good. They want it so bad. Uh, they wanted us to win so bad over the last few years and just to be able to here to be able to pay them back and, and to pay this back to the city and to the country is uh, it's amazing. Freddie, congratulations on being an NBA champion. Thank you, Kate.